Hi, my name is Deborah Metzgerville, and I was asked to do a series of videos in regards to my webpage by my SEO guru, and so here I am. And I'd like to explain to you a little bit about who I am and what it is that I do. I'm actually a trained shaman, and I specialize in soul retrieval for PTSD and trauma. It took me years and years to get here. I was trained in Western medicine first. I was a paramedic for about 10 years. My specialty was psychological emergencies and crisis intervention, and then I actually was trained in dialectical behavioral therapy, which is one of the only therapies that has an 87% success rate in treating people with mood disorders. I did that for years where I had a group home for about 10 years after being a paramedic when I left that field. And the entire time I was searching spiritually and also acquired a doctorate in divinity. So which just means I know a little bit about a lot of different religions and practices. What happened was is that after 10 years of running that program through a series of events and a dark night of the soul myself, I went to Costa Rica and did 14 days of ayahuasca. If you can live through 14 days of ayahuasca, I guarantee you that your life has changed. I came home, realized what was missing in regards to a lot of programs and that is the soul retrieval piece and gutted my program and began doing three day weekend retreats. I can tell you that all entheogens can be extraordinarily helpful in regards to trauma and PTSD. There is no one right entheogen for anyone. So people that tell me that they were healed uh, with San Pedro or ayahuasca or peyote or mushrooms, i.e. psilocybin or LSD, absolutely, all of those work. And they work because again, they affect our subconscious done correctly. Again, that component of soul retrieval is what's available for everyone. So what people say is that they are able to take 10 years of therapy and put it into a five hour ceremony and that's where the healing is at. I can tell you that that's absolutely accurate. For me, being trained in dialectical behavioral therapy, doing my own therapy and still not receiving again the peace and the joy and the authenticness of my being, only happened after doing ayahuasca and continues to happen even as I lead ceremonies and others. So again, we offer a three-day psilocybin retreat. A Friday night, we do a cacao ceremony, which is the chocolate, again, that you drink. It's a heart opener and it also produces oxytocin in the brain. It makes you feel deeply connected to yourself and to others, and that's where we set our intentions. Saturday morning, I do cambo. Cambo is a difficult medicine and it's about purging. So you purge emotionally, spiritually, physically. Cambo is an amazing toad venom that comes from the Amazon and it kind of sets the stage many times. Being clean and clear, be able to sit oh, again with a psilocybin ceremony. And then Saturday night, we do a full shamanic psilocybin ceremony. Uh, again, we call back people's missing soul pieces. I train everybody ahead of time in regards to a slide presentation that I have, in regards to what soul retrieval is, about how to journey into lower world, how to receive your totem animal or your guide. Any and all of those things are available to you. Again, I have people that sit in ceremony that say, you know, that angels spoke to them, their guides spoke to them, loved ones that have passed have spoke to them. I've never had a person that's come to one of my ceremonies that said that nothing happened. So again, ceremony is different than just doing it either on your own or at a party. It's completely different. The energy is different. But the calling in of the healing energy uh, to receive your soul pieces is different. And I can tell you that it is life changing and I look forward to meeting you if this resonates with you. I'm available. You can fill out the form uh, that's going to appear here. We do not spam you. I send out an email about once a month to tell people where we're at. We are stationed in Washington. However, I travel across the United States and into Canada and I'd love for you to come and sit within one of our ceremonies. They're small. I only take five people at a time. So it's very intimate. We get to know you. We get to figure out what it is that you want in regards to healing and we hold that space and opportunity for that to happen for you. Thanks so much for stopping by and I look forward to connecting with you soon.